everyone. Do 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 do. Stop. Oh my god. Uh, first off, I just want to just say this. I'm very sorry if you can hear a clicking noise in the background because my camera is broken, I guess. And I think I can hear, I can even hear it from like there. <laughs> and I don't know what to do about it because I'm not good with cameras. So there's going to be a clicking noise and I'm sorry. So today I thought I would do this game called Who Am I? My mom's friend gave it to me. I think for my birthday, maybe. I'm not quite sure. Basically what it is, it's like, Um, how much you know, how much you know really knows, how much you know really know yourself, how much you know really know yourself. This entertaining game will provide the answers and may teach you a thing or two that you might not want to admit. Answering multiple choice questions provided by the other con con contestants. This fun and enlightening quiz will give the insights into your own physique and prove that when it comes to admitting your true self, it's best to lay your cards on the table. 50 question cards and scoring system. I'm going to need a, a piece of paper of some sort. Do, 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 do. Am I really low? I'm super low, but can you see my face? Hopefully you can see my face. I don't know. I, this is actually really uncomfortable. This feedback chair is really hard to sit in. And then when you sit in it, you sink like the Titanic. Oh god, too soon? That's better, but my legs are like awkwardly up. Okay, so I have paper, pen thing, scorecard, and the questiones. So this is what the cards look like. Who am I? Let's see if I'm an angel or a realist or a wild geek or loop the loop. Okay, ready? Here I go. Are these cards numbered? I actually think that they're supposed to be in some sort of order. You know what? It's fine. Okay, so you catch your 14 year of niece. There's definitely some typos. You catch your 14 of me smoking. Do you A, find it amusing. B, tell her dad that you won't tell her, tell, tell her that you won't tell her dad this time. C, tell her dad. D, lecture her about the dangers of smooth smoking. I think I'm gonna D, I think these are definitely um, not in the right order. So I'm just gonna, I would lecture her about the dangers of smoking. You know what? I'm just gonna go one through, cause it's like in order, one through 50. So I'm just gonna say this is number one. So D, that's two. Okay. So two, all right. I think I'm only going to do 25 just because, you know. That would take a while to do 50, so. You're invited to a job interview. You'd love the role. You're invited to a job interview. You'd love the role, but you don't have the qualifications required. Do you? <clears throat> Lie about qualifications you haven't even taken and hope that nobody checks. Admit that you don't have the qualifications, but you're willing to learn. Exaggerate your experience and hope that it will make up for your missing qualifications or twist the truth and just the truth a little about the grades you achieved. <clears throat> I would probably do B. So that's B is three points. I, this is definitely off, but you know. Next, your father-in-law asked to borrow your expensive camera. Photography is your passion and you really don't want to lend it to anyone. Do you let him borrow it? Then get straight on the phone to the insurers. <laughs> Say the lunch is broken, so it's not working. <laughs> so it's not in working order at the moment. Give him a straight no, or say he can borrow it, but any damages, but any damages and he will be responsible for covering all costs. I would probably go, 
either B or D, so I'm gonna say D, so he can borrow it, but any dangers, danger, any damages, and he will be responsible. Cause if he, if he breaks them, gotta make that money. So that's number three, and that's a one. So far we are at six points, and we have, I, this is gonna take a very long time. I think I'm only going to do 10, cause this is gonna, okay. You're working in a restaurant. When a customer asks to have his leftover pizza box, you head it back to the kitchen just as a staff member is throwing it into the bin. Do you? Oh no. <clears throat> ask your box, box, ask the box what you should do. So ask your boss what you should do. Scrape it out of the bin and box it regardless. Ooh. Apologize to the customer or the customer and explain what happened or make the person who threw it away confess to the customer. I would probably apologize to the customer and explain what happened because I'm scraping out of the bin. Oh my God, that's awful. Okay, so number four, C is three. Yeah, definitely not correct. Maybe it is correct, I know. This, this card game has some faults. <clears throat> Your friend has found her perfect wedding dress. You think it looks awful on her. Do you <clears throat> tactfully, tactfully persuade her to try on some other dresses? Tell her it looks nice, but you think there's better out there. Tell her straight out that the dress looks awful. Oh, that's mean. Or tell her she looks beautiful. It's her big day after all. I'm not really one to say stuff about that. So I'm gonna go with D. Tell her she looks beautiful. It's her big day after all. You know, if she likes a dress, so be it. She can be happy. You know, if it's my friend, she can wear what she wants to wear. So that was number five. One point. Okay, so if I'm doing 10 and there's 50, I'll just multiply my score by five and see what I get. That works. Your partner in crime has been arrested for a crime. Do you? Oh, your partner has been arrested for a crime. Do you create a fictional story to give him slash her an alibi? That's lying. B, stand by him slash her, innocent until proven guilty. But they did it. Like, tell the police to throw away the key. <laughs> or D, start your own investigation. I don't really want to do any of these, so I'm going to say I would s start my own investigation because... They're, they are my friend, but if they did it, then I don't, I don't know. I'd, so that's another one for, for D. I, okay. So, wow, look at that lighting difference. I mean, um, my camera died, or the battery died in my camera. So this is probably really loud. I am back. It's like three hours later and I have a whoopie pie. Mm. Yeah, that's good. It's an Oreo one too, not just any ordinary one. Okay, here we go. Wait, where's my pen? Penny pen, 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 pen. Well, it appears that I've lost my pen, so that's too bad. Maybe I'll just... Yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna do. Um... You wanna leave? Well, that's too bad you're stuck with me. Let's say, let's say, <clears throat> okay, I'll just remember my score. So I'm at five, six, nine, ten, eleven. 11. I'm at 11, so I'll just add up after onto 11. So I'm at six, I have four more left. Okay, so some social media, social media is a great way to see what everybody's having for their evening meal, socialize with friends, uh, stock an ex, or check up on people. I'm just gonna say, check up on people because I don't really care about other people's meals okay so we're at 11 this is number seven two okay two plus 13 we're at a 13 now okay next you're involved in a car accident luckily you escape uninjured however you feel sure that you get away with a claim for whiplash do you a struggle from the car holding your neck <clears throat> put the thought straight out of your mind it's dishonest and wrong Feel a little guilty whilst heading up to the local hospital for a checkup, or 
go straight to Google search to check the average payout for a whiplash. I'd probably feel a little guilty while heading to a local hospital for a checkup. Yeah. So let's see. Number eight. One. But I was 14. I'm at 14. Okay, next. Two more. You're boarding a flight when the attendant mistakes you for a celebrity and insists on upgrading you to first class. Do you? Mumble, thanks. Put your sunglasses on and head straight for first class. Laugh at him. Laugh and tell slash him slash her that they're mistaken. Give a big whoop of delight and offer your autograph in return. I would not be able to pull that off. Are you serious? My autograph would be like... And scribble. That would not work. Or thoroughly enjoy first class treatment while taking advantage of as many freebies as possible. See, as much as I think that I... Like would take it i probably wouldn't because then i'd be like what if they find out so i have to go with b laugh and tell them that they're mistaken because i would not be able to be able to think that i was a celebrity <laughs> and just because let's be honest here i'm not a celebrity nine two i was at 14 to 16 all right last one guys let's make it a good one all right, well, fine. You need to raise money quickly for a good cause. Oh, that's nice, that sounds like me. Well, it's kind of, not really. Would you rather <clears throat> bungee jump from the Golden Gate Bridge? See, that's like, bungee, jump, bungee jumping's one of those things that I wouldn't really want to do. Um, skydive from a hot air balloon. I actually, <clears throat> I actually do want to go skydiving. Um, see, climb the Statue of Liberty, or sit on the Grand Canyon Skywalk for 12 hours. That's way too boring. So I'd actually probably want to skydive, because I want to skydive when I get older. So yeah, I'm going to go with B on this. So number 9, I was at 16, so 2. Now I'm at 18. Now 90, 90, 90. That's, that's, that's 10. That's the last one, isn't it? Yeah, that was the last one. Um... So that was one, so 15. 15 times five is 120, no, that's 15 squared. Um, excuse me, do you want to leave? Well, that's too bad. <laughs> okay, 15 times five. 15 times two is 30, times two is 60, plus 15, 75. So, um, I'm not an angel. I'm not a realist. I'm a wild geek. Now you certainly are a mix of characters. One day, the hardworking geek and the next. Oh. One day, the hardworking geek and the next, the life and soul of the party. Your traits are so extreme, even you don't know what's coming next. That's, um. I wouldn't say that's, um. false. So, you, you are cheeky, mm -hmm. with a dash of wickedness thrown in, and like a chameleon, you can adapt to your surroundings. This versatility gives you unlimited path, 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 <laughs> I can't talk, pathways in which your life might take, especially if you can tolerate certain individuals who are otherwise being ignored. You know, that actually pretty, uh, pretty describes me, right describes me pretty well like i'm not gonna lie it's basically me in life um yeah well so that was it for who am i i hope you enjoyed and maybe you learned a little bit more about me maybe i think i learned a little bit more about myself like I had to look, really look inside me and see what I've done. And my cat really wants to get out. Let me come here. Oh, you can help me with the outro. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, give this video a thumbs up for him. Because he's so cute. And I love cats. So, uh, and subscribe. Because you should. And I will see you next time. Oh, also, I think I'm going to do a little update. So, you know how I was watching The 100? Well, I finished it. 
like all the episodes that are out. I watched them till season season <laughs> season eight, season three, episode eight, because that was the last one that was available. And now I have to wait another like two. Oh, you have like a. There's a bump there. What the heck? Are you okay? Uh, I so saw I have to wait another week and a half, or is it this Thursday? Yeah, this. No, no, Thursday after this Thursday is when the next episode comes out. And I'm really like, I don't know. I don't really want to watch it anymore. Uh, but since. Alicia Deb Deb Nam Carey is in Fear the Walking Dead and she's like not the main person but she's in there like a lot I've been watching that and I'm on episode 5 and it's alright I mean the only reason I'm watching it is because of her which is kind of sad but you know like a little baby ah 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 I'm being attacked <laughs> oh <clears throat> Saying, goo hoo 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 